With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Our question is, platinum atomic radius 1.38 angstrom crystallizes in a cubic close packed structure. Calculate the edge length of the face centered cubic unit cell and the density of the platinum the atomic weight of platinum is given what is which is 195 so they are saying that the platinum is basically crystallizing in a cubic close packed arrangement right and that is what that is fcc arrangement phase centered cubic unit cell arrangement calculate the edge length now atomic radius given to us is 1.38 angstrom and they are saying us to calculate the edge length that is the edge length of the unit cell that is a value and the density of the platinum right so first of all we're going to calculate the edge length how we're going to calculate the edge length we know that in case of face centered cubic arrangement the atoms are present at face centers plus at corners so if we draw our typical face centered cubic unit cell we're going to have atoms present at face centers right for example, we have this, these two face centers, then these two and then these two. We have a total of six face centers and then the atoms are present at corners as well, right? So, this is our face centered cubic unit cell, right? How it looks like. Now, if we talk about the value of A, how, how are we going to calculate the value of A? Over here, if we take this particular face diagonal, right? In this case, we know this is our cell edge length A. This is also our cell edge length A. So, what this would be? This would be root 2A according to Pythagoras theorem because it would be x square would be equal to what? A square plus A square. So, this would be 2A square. So, x would be equal to under root of 2A square. So, that means it would be what? It would be root 2A right the x value would be root 2a that means this is our root 2a now if we suppose magnify this and look at the arrangement of the atoms the arrangement of atom is like this one atom is present over here and the two atoms are present over here like this so we have r this total is 2r and this is over over here r right so we have total of this is what this is 4r so 4r over here is equal to what this is equal to root 2a now we have to find the value of a a would be equal to 4r by root 2 right so we know the value of r which is 1.38 so we're going to multiply it with 1.38 and divide it by root 2 and root 2 is what root 2 has a value of 1.414 this would be this answer would be in what in angstrom right so when we solve this we get a value of a which is equal to 3.9 angstrom right so this is the answer to part 1 that what is the edge length of the unit cell and that is coming out to be 3.9 angstrom so this is the value of so this is the value of our cell edge length the edge length that is 3.9 angstrom right now we are supposed to find out the density and to calculate the density we know the formula z m by n a into a cube z is the number of atoms present in each unit cell m is the mass of the atoms n a is the avogadro's number and a is the cell edge length so we're going to put the values now in case of fcc arrangement we know there's a value of z is 4 how is the value 4 because they are present as face centers we have total six face center each has a contribution of 1 by 2 plus we have eight corners and each has a contribution of 1 by 8 so this goes by 1 and this goes by 3 so we have 3 plus 1 that is total four atoms in each unit cell so the value of z is 4 and then we're going to multiply it with the mass the mass given to us was 195 the mass was 195 so we're gonna put it over here 195 divided by the value of na na is what avogadro's number 6.023 into 10 raised to power 23 multiply it with the a cube a value was uh, was 3.9 angstrom so 3.9 we're gonna multiply it with 10 raised to power minus 8 to find out the value in centimeters right so this would be a cube right when we solve this all what we get we get a density value of 21.83 gram per centimeter cube right so the density we are getting is in gram per centimeter cube how because we are taking this 195 in grams right and this value in centimeter so the density that we are getting is 21.83 gram per centimeter cube so this is the answer to our first part and this is the answer to our second part of the question for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.